So let's talk about how to rewrite equations into the slope intercept form of a line. Sometimes you want to do that. So what is the slope intercept form of a line? So this is something you should already know coming into this. If you're not familiar with this, I do have other videos where I break this down, but just as a quick refresher. So the slope intercept form of a line is this y equals mx plus b where m is the slope and b is the y intercept. So the y intercept has this form zero comma b. Okay, so I've talked about in other videos how to graph with this and kind of how to break this down. But now what I wanna do is I wanna look at kind of examples like this, where these are not in slope intercept form. And this is kind of inconvenient. Some, sometimes this is good and sometimes this is not good. It just totally depends on the circumstances. So sometimes you want equations that look like this to be in that slope intercept form. So how do you do that? Well, the thing to remember is that the slope intercept form is this y equals mx plus b. So in looking at this, it really looks like you basically just solve for y. And so that's it in a nutshell. That's really what you need to do is just go about solving for y. So in this case, what I wanna do first is I wanna subtract off the two x. So I have negative four y equals negative two x plus eight like this. And then to finish isolating the y, what I'll do is I will just divide each part of the problem by negative four. And then that basically breaks this into little mini problems and you can figure out what, what the final answer should be. So in this case, this is gonna be y equals positive one half minus two. And so now check it out, we're in the slope intercept form. I can tell the slope is one half, the y-intercept is negative two, so we're all good to go here. So that's kind of what we're breaking down in this video. So what I wanna do now is I, I wanna show you maybe one more example. If you feel like you've got it, maybe pause here and try this yourself. So I wanna put this, this equation into slope intercept form. So I've got six y plus, or six y minus three x equals 12. So first things first, I'm gonna add the three x to both sides. So I get six y equals three x plus 12. And then I'll divide each part by six. And so now I get y equals one half x plus two. And so I just happen to have the same slope again, but you, you've got the idea here. Okay, so I've got one more example of this. This is a super quick video. So if I wanted to put this particular equation into slope intercept form, so we've got negative five x plus two y equals negative four. So first things first, bring the x over to the other side like this. So I get two y equals 5x minus 4, and then divide each side by 2 to get y equals 5 over 2x minus 2. And so now we've got it in the slope intercept form, so we're good to go. And so that's it for this video. So very short, but just wanted to kind of show you what do you do if you don't have that desired format. Hopefully this was helpful, guys. I'll catch you next time.